Hi, I'm Adam and I'm from the Center for Change Making and Social Innovation. And the way I rise, create and innovate is I've turned this old bookshelf into a living green wall in my office. I challenge Nicole Norris, Susie Addison Tour and Christina Hiles to see how you rise, create and innovate. <laughs>I'm Greg Anderson from the School of Health, Wellness, and Sciences, where we love to innovate. And I want to see how you can rise, create, and innovate. Back when the pandemic first hit, a lot of us were in a real pickle. I was teaching physics online, which is normally a very interactive, fun class with me and my students. I also had another issue. I had a couple of people at home with me. So I thought, what better way to make it a fun, interactive experience than to get some people to help me? Here are a few examples. Harder, a little bit harder. Hey, Laura, you can do it too. A little bit harder, don't miss. A little bit harder, one more time. Three, two, one, go. Very good. Now, I wanna see how you can rise, create, and innovate. I nominate Sean Madoran, Tim Gabor, and Melissa Bassoriello. Good luck. Hi, my name is Isabel Desha, and I'm a faculty in the Human Services at the Aurea campus. And this is how I rise, create, and innovate during the pandemic. First challenge was finding an office space that would be quiet as we're building a house and away from the foster kitten. The second challenge was finding a way to keep students engaged while teaching remotely. So I used um, several tools in H5P. Another challenge was finding therapy for our dog. So we learned how to go swimming in the lake by our house. And the last challenge was learning how to do some of the renovations or building yourself, such as drywalling. I now challenge Jamie Doran, James Fielding and Kelly Duggan to tell us how they rise, create and innovate. Hi there, my name is Hadi and I work for the uh, Research and Innovation Department in Georgian College. Here in our department, our group rises, creates and innovates uh, during each and every project that we work with our industrial partners. I'm going to show you one example uh, of how we are helping a local company with their packaging needs. So here I'm showing a dry run of this robotic application where the collaborative robot would pick up these packages and place them in four corners of a box. Thanks for watching and I nominate my colleagues Andrew Saibeng and Lale Khodaharast. My name is Ross Bigelow and I'm the program coordinator for the Lakehead Georgian Computer Science Partnership and the Artificial Intelligence Program, as well as a faculty lead researcher. When the pandemic first hit, my children wanted to skate, so I had to create and innovate this homemade ice rink, including this Amboni. I challenge my colleagues Tim Korolik and Rob Ferriero, as well as my students in both the computer science programs and artificial intelligence programs, to share with us how you rise, create, and innovate as well. My name is Mackenzie, and I work for the Georgian College Research and Innovation Department as a student researcher. I rise, create, and innovate by helping our team with solid models on projects such as this. Hi, I'm Mira Ray, Director of Research and Innovation at Georgian College. During the pandemic lockdowns, my friends and I didn't want to lose sight of our fitness goals. So we created a shared Google document that listed things like exercise, water intake, and mindfulness activities. It was our way of staying connected and accountable to each other during the lockdowns. <laughs> Using these online tools is how I rise, create, and innovate. Isabel Deschamps, Ross Bigelow, and Greg Anderson, as well as our research students and research associates, Connor McGinnis, Muscon Carwal, Eric Jiang, Gregory Gavilanes Heredia, and Mackenzie Thayer. I challenge you to show us how you rise, create, and innovate.